works. Uh, here, I put product in quotes. All right, let's go. Let's go. Hello. Welcome, everybody. Oh, we got a Mad Tasty here. Mad Tasty. If anyone ever, if any drink companies ever want to sponsor Kama, you know, we'd, uh, we'd love to have you. Um, preferably something a bit light on the sugar, you know. Uh, link works. You like, you like my background? This is, this is my poster in my office. Um, so let's give everyone a minute to get in here. My board just says Tiny Gratic Comma. Uh, it's my uh, large monitor. I set up plant automation today. Look at this automation. Love automation, guys. Um, what do we have to show you? Oh, are there any secrets on the... I don't know if I can show you. We have, like, fancy new metrics boards, but I don't think I can show them to you. Um, what is that thing? What, what, what is that? What is that? I'm zooming in. What is it? It's moving. Are those, are those cat ears? <laughs> Wait, it might even talk. Oh yeah, look, it's making its way over here. Wow. Let's see if it's a friend. Hello, friend. Can 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 you oh you, you hit down there. Can can you talk? You can just blink your eyes. Oh, that's cool. Can can can, can you hear me? Oh, 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 all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Um, yeah, I mean, you know, it's, it's a, will it fall? No way, it's got wheels! <laughs> um, yeah, so, uh, you know, there'll be some cool announcements at Comic-Con. At Comic-Con, you can, you can come over here, you can come on in here, it's, it's, it's good. Um, There'll be some cool announcements at Comic Con related to the Comma body. Uh, look, guys, it's a, come here, come here. It's using machine learning technology for this, and by machine learning technology, I mean it's remote control in the same way the cruise cars are. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I, I wish you could you could talk, and the talking worked. Oh, okay. It said something. It's like Pikachu. It just says Pikachu. Okay, all right, well, you know, he's just gonna, Kenny's just gonna, is this Kenny or, or Bob or Billy? I don't know. Oh, okay, okay, I, I hear you. Um, George, you banned me on Twitch, but you can't ban me everywhere. Bro, I just banned you. Easy, okay. Uh, so, 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 we are, uh, yeah, no, we banned him, it's all good. Uh, you know, some people, that's their moment of fame. Okay, so we're here for a product announcement. We're here for a product announcement. Uh, does, does, uh, does our friend here know what the product announcement is? I don't think he does. He's not... Okay, okay, I hear you, I hear you. Um... Is that a comma one on the body? No, this is a comma three. Oh, oh, you like it because it's green. No, he just has a green, uh, green side. Um, we have a product announcement today, and there's 213 people here. That's a good number of people. Uh, there's secrets everywhere, so I can't, you know, there's so many secrets for Comic-Con. Uh, if you're not coming, by the way, Comic-Con, guys. Let's see. Uh, this isn't secret. This is just tiny grad. Um... Let's let's look at the web page for Comic Con. Let's let's go through Comic Con here. Want to understand the true future of self-driving cars and robotics? Okay, you can you can you can go home, and you can chill if you want, but you can also go home. Oh, he's listening. Oh, that's great. I think he can hear us. Bye, bye 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 bye, body. Oh, he's a little drunk. That's, that's, you know, it's a holiday. Um, <laughs> uh, want to understand the true future of self-driving cars and robotics? Come to Comic-Con, an IRL event full of technical talks from our people. Uh, 
Deeb's going to talk. Uh, Deeb's the head of Open Pilot. Harold's going to talk. He's our CTO. Uh, Wei Xing's going to talk. Uh, he works on driver monitoring. Uh, and then we got burgers for lunch. Uh, Rovi's going to talk. He works on our hardware. Greg's going to talk. He runs our infrastructure. Yassine's going to talk. He works on our ML uh, training. And I'm going to talk. Uh, and then we have uh, Jason from Discord who's going to talk. Happy hour in the Kami Awards. Flatbreads and tendies. I heard we got demos and they were delicious. And then um, some up-close demos. So uh, you can get tickets right here. Uh, there's only 23 early saver tickets remaining. And then you'll be stuck with a general admission ticket. So I recommend buying your tickets uh, right now. Uh, will it be recorded? Probably, but do not miss it. Come in real life. Because things happen in real life, not on the internet. The internet is all fake. Um, also, VIP. Uh, we've sold three VIP tickets so far. Um, I think you'll be very happy if you buy a VIP ticket. Uh, we have a candle at dinner. Uh, there's going to be candles. Um, it's it's going to be good. Uh, it's just like the cruise cars. The body's just like the cruise cars. It's autonomous, uh, if you consider that autonomous. Um, VIP, also, oh, it's in San Diego. Uh, this was some pictures from Comic-Con last year. It's at the same place. Uh, so it's uh, going to be uh, fun. Uh, the product is not just a shill. The product is not just a shill to get you in here. Um, but I don't know if the product's ready yet. Let me uh, head over to OpenPilot and see if the product is ready. How's our product coming? How's our product coming? Uh, wait, 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 are there secrets everywhere? Yeah, oh, there's secrets. Okay, okay. What? Uh, okay, you're merging our product now. All right, great. Uh, where are the secrets? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's far away. They can't see anything on this desk. You're going to get some, like, zoomed-in, blurry picture, and they're going to be like, damn, we figured it out. Comma selling puppies. Um, wish it worked on early C3. No, it doesn't work on early C3s. Uh, it only works on C3s that have come out in the last year. Um, so... So, 261, we're still growing. We can't do the product announcement yet. We gotta build up the hype, you know? After this commercial break. Okay, the commercial's over, but don't worry, we're still not gonna tell you who gets eliminated from the island, because otherwise, how would we fill a 42-minute TV spot with this reality show? Uh, okay, we have, like, metrics over there. They're too blurry for you to see. Um, should we visit Alex? Let's visit Alex. Uh, well, we can't visit Alex because there's no Alex. We're going to go downstairs. I know you're excited about the product announcement, but it's not time yet. It's not time yet. We'll give it, we'll give it a few more minutes. Let's go take a look at downstairs. Let's go to our factory. Uh, by the way, if you want to come work here, uh, this is a very chill place to work. Uh, you can come work here and like, we're going to solve, we're going to win guys. Uh, you know, and I know I've been saying this for a long time. Turns out winning just takes a long-ass time. But, like, you seen everyone with the driving simulators? Like, commoditize your compliment. Love it. There's going to be simulators. We got a network. We're ready to go. Uh, let's go in over here. Um, work sounds bad. Well, if work's not for you, then this is not for you. But if you'd like to work, it's a very chill place to work. All right. And just swipe into this door here. Let's go. We don't have any secrets, right? These are normal comma threes, right? No secrets. Oh, check out, these are the comma threes before they get made. Look at these, I think these boards are half populated or are they just empty? These are just empty boards. But they go in here. Oh look, it's an Alex. And then this is a jet printer. This machine is a pick and place machine. Puts all the parts on the board. We're fixing up some old boards here. Uh, this is our reflow oven. Hey, Alex. I got news for you. We're live. We're live? Yeah. What do you mean you got news for me? Oh, oh, it's live. Oh. Oh. No, I didn't tell anyone what it was yet, but they don't know. Oh, no. Well, good. The website takes a while to push anyway. Um, great. Uh, yeah, this is our inspection. We inspect all the common three boards. Look at super precise cameras. Okay, wait, I gotta go. 
we got to go do the announcement. I mean, maybe this is the right place to do it. Yeah. Right here in the middle of the production floor. We have some comma threes here on the stress test. All right, all right, all right, we're doing it, we're doing it, we're doing it. Today, the comma three, comma care, extended warranty goes live. You guys have been asking for it for years, for years. And today we are finally at a place in a company where we can actually do it. And I'll tell you guys, this is going to print money. Uh, this is going to print money, you know, because the failure rate is low, but if you want Warranty, if you want that peace of mind, you should buy it. It's $400 and it just extends your factory warranty to two years instead of one. Uh, so yeah, that's the product. Uh, is the website really live? Do you want to like bring it up on your phone and we'll stream from your phone? Oh, we have a computer in here. Over here. Oh, we use this to buy things off Amazon? I see. Oh, okay. Just go to the go to the website. What is it? Comma AI. I think so. <laughs> oh, good website. Oh, wow. You can buy a comma three, and when you buy a comma three, wait, wait, wait. Where is it? Oh, body. Oh, those. Oh, comma care. Whoa! The comma care extended warranty. Now, you can buy this either with a new comma three, or with a comma three up to one year. If you do not have a comma device, you can buy the extended warranty, but it's a donation. Um, we do love donations. Purchase an additional year of warranty coverage, and then you can read a bunch of fine print. Alex, would you like to read some fine print to the people? Yes, so the warranty um, does not apply to bulk discount orders. And if mm. you've made an international purchase and you have a warranty claim, it's the same as our current warranty situation where you mail your device to us and we will cover the shipping costs back. Um, it's not applied to common twos, so please don't ask. And uh, it does, just like our limited hardware uh, warranty against defects, it does not apply to accidental damage. So if you drop your device, break your screen. Wait, I'm, I'm literally, we're literally getting booed right now. They're booing. Why? What's this happening? has got to be a prank? What do you mean? Don't buy it if you don't like it. Lots of people ask for this. Yeah. Um, if you're not interested, we're not forcing it on you, but. It's just like, hey, if you're worried about your device and you want to extend your warranty, you can. You know, you just can't make people happy, man. It doesn't, the warranty doesn't affect you if you don't buy it. Wait, maybe it's just one guy booing. That's often the case. That's often the case. Just ordered a Tesla after watching this. <laughs> um, you look, guys. Uh, Calling a warranty a product. Oh, they wanted a product. Oh, guys, you're going to have to come to Comic-Con for that. Oh, oh, you wanted a product announcement. That's why product was in quotes. Whenever it's in quotes, it's never what you want. Today you learned about quotes. <laughs> I'm literally crying right now. Look, you don't have to buy it. That's the price, right? If you want to sell $100, $200 warranties, you're welcome to, but we sell them for $400 and we make a shit ton of money on them. But to be fair, people are always asking about this. They're like, what if I break my advice out of warranty? Guess what? A comma three with a two year warranty is cheaper than a comma three was last year. For 1900, you can get the comma three and the warranty for less than a comma three cost last year. Do it for three years, it's two. <laughs> um, should raise the common three price and include harness. We, we can think about that. The parts availability is amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're getting rid of it now that we sell extended warranties. No, just kidding. Uh, look, we support the products. The comma two failed. The comma two was not our best product. Uh, you know, we were... It's hard to run a profitable company. It's hard to run a company when you actually try to make money and don't just want to do scams. Um, but no, it was okay. I mean, it was decent. It was cool for what it was, but we didn't have the maturity that the Comma 3 has. We now have a big fancy factory making all these things. Um, company's failing. It's news to me, bro. Uh, uh, 
Behind this door, we have profitability. Uh, is this a no fault warranty? No, if you break, if you like break the screen, I'm not gonna give you a new screen, but if it breaks in normal usage, we'll fix it. Uh, how are sales? Sales are way up uh, since uh, we lowered the price. Sales have doubled uh, since we dropped the price to $14.99. Uh, so they, do, they, they went up so much that we actually went on back order for the comma three. Um, if you think $400 is too much, I don't think it's that far off from Apple. Uh, you know, it's, it's an option. People are always asking, we're giving you an option. Lovely option for the peace of mind. Thank you. Thank you for the positivity, good sir. Um... How much is a Steam Deck? I don't know. I don't sell Steam Decks. All right, let's, uh... Oh, yes, and if you just joined, uh, Comic-Con. Comic-Con is our yearly conference, bi-yearly. Um, what typically kills a comma? Does it count if the body falls? No, but we have something to address that, and you'll have to come to Comic-Con for that. Um, no, a comma's been... Comfortably profitable for the year. Uh, we, we got the sales boost we needed. What we're focusing on now in that factory, um, we're doing a lot of stuff to like, okay, so like our accounting um, historically was just, uh, was just like asset-based accounting. We weren't tracking COGS correctly. Uh, so we didn't exactly know how much a given comma three cost to make. We had a ballpark idea, but um, we're working on just improving this a ton uh, we've made some parts changes to the Comma 3, completely seamless to use. Screen has changed. The uh, cameras have changed. Uh, and we figured out how to get... They're, they're both cheaper and better. They're, like, literally, if, if, you, if you buy things in bulk and you plan things, you can get things that are both cheaper and better, and this is how you build incredible consumer electronics. Uh, do I expect additional price drops? No, right now we're working on... It's not about dropping the price, it's about increasing our margins, right? So I, did, I took a hit to margins when I, when I, uh, when I lowered the price. Um, you know, I'd, I'd like to get our margins back to 60%, and they're not at 60% right now. Um, how much do we pay software engineers at Comma? Uh, again, if you're looking to like, oh, I'm going to maximize my TCO, yeah, go work at a fang and do nothing with your life. Uh, but if you want a comfortable salary... Uh, I think we pay between 80 and 150, uh, and then you can choose equity, and how much equity you choose depends on how uh, the salary, uh, how much equity you choose depends on how much salary you get. If you want more equity, you get less salary. If you want more salary, you get uh, less equity. Uh, I mean, look, we had an employee buy a house off his comma stock. There's money in it. Um... Any remote opportunities? We don't have opportunities, periodly. Uh, period. I, I, I hate that uh, word. What the hell is an opportunity? You want to work remotely? Contribute to GitHub, right? Uh, you want a job remotely? Well, I'll think about it after you contribute to GitHub for a while. Um, the Tiny Corp's all remote. Uh, my other company, the Tiny Corp, is all remote. Uh, but again, the bar's even higher to get hired, so... Heavy device falls off the glass and I have to glue it back constantly. Buy a mount, follow the instructions, and I promise you won't have to do that. Uh, make sure you clean the windshield good and make sure you leave it up there to dry for like 24 to 48 hours and you'll never have to stick it on again. Why doesn't comma register some representatives? Yeah, someday we'll have to do this. Uh, someday we'll have to do this. We'll have like, like, like qualified installers and you'll go through like a... You know what? I really, I'd like someone else to manage this and take the profit from it. Um, but we'll set it up if we have to. Uh, it can verify you're paying attention if you're wearing sunglasses. Again, there, a lot of the DM now is end-to-end. -end. It's just like looking at you. Like If a human in the seat next to you can tell whether you're paying attention, the Comma 3 can tell. Um, you have side cameras. The Comma 3 is a 360 cam. Great work on the new cabana. That's all Dean Lee, I believe. I think Dean Lee and, uh, and Willem wrote that. Um, what about an update on the comma three lifespan? 
I mean, lifespan of devices is however well you take care of it and stuff, you know? They don't, like, they don't have an expiry date. It's not like eggs, bro. Love the new product. Thank you. Thank you. I love the positivity. Um, so let's figure out how many we sold. Let's see if we can get that. Uh, can we can we get at how many we sold? If someone at Comma is watching this and wants to post it on uh, on, on Slack. Uh, was the DM model trained on hand labeled data? Yes, some of it. Uh, it's boosted. We have some. We did some hand labeling and we did some automatic classification. It's 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 a combination. Uh, does it work with Chinese EVs? Uh, I'm not sure. I don't know any that do. Uh, the 3D print for your ODB port disconnected. I don't think so. What, you mean your comma power? The 3D printer? I don't think so. Um, didn't I leave the company? I'm the president of the company. I don't work here every day. Um, I do... Uh, no, I mean, the company's mostly independent now. I mean, you know, Alex and Harold uh, run the day-to-day, uh, -day, Adib. I was having a leave in the company. Um, what happened to marketing intern? Well, my deal with Kama about being a marketing intern, and someone said, you know, I thought about this a little bit. It's like, we've never had a thousand comma threes in stock. Once we have a thousand comma threes in stock, the marketing intern will return, and I got some sick marketing ideas. Um, it did disconnect. W what do you mean? Like post a post a picture on Discord and we'll take a look. Uh, when are we? Where are we on Navigate on Open Pilot? Come to Comic Con! Come to Comic Con and you will hear all about Navigate on Open Pilot. Uh, can you develop a magnetic, easily removable mount? Why do you want to remove the device? Leave it on your windshield. How does heat affect the Comma Three? Should be fine. Uh, I mean, sometimes. Uh, sometimes you, uh, okay, stop spamming chat. If you spam chat, banned. Um, can I sell you a digital pass to Comic Con? You think I'm going to sell digital passes? You think I'm an IP scammer, bro? Um, what, we'll give you the VIP digital experience? Come on. Come on. You think I do that? It's going to be streamed, probably. I don't know. We'll see if I want to pay the streamers. Um, where might you find more information on the design role? Do you really want it? If you really want it, you don't have to ask me that question. You'll find plenty of information. Where do you really find more information? You, you want to get hired for design at Comma? Go contribute to OpenPilot. Go contribute designs to OpenPilot. Get people to start using them in Discord, and I'm like, damn, that's who we want to hire. You know what I mean? Um, literally, go, you know what's terrible? Our lane change UI. Go commit a better lane change UI to, to OpenPilot and show that you have design skills by doing that. I mean, even if, you, you know, you should be able to code too. Everyone should be able to code, but... Um, what, the heat? The counter should be fine. I mean, sometimes it overheats, and it'll tell you that it overheats uh, pretty rarely. But yeah, if you leave it out in the baking sun, it's going to take a little bit to cool down. Um, but it's not going to break the device. No, it's not like Elon saying, I'll pay you if I like your system. That's, that's doing six months of work. I'm asking you to do a week of work. And if you're not willing to do a week of work to get a job you're going to have for five years, I, I don't know how to help you, man. Um, how does the latest build compare with FSD? We're focused on different things from FSD, but like we're getting there. We're, we're, we're working on the same uh, you know, sort of stuff. Navigate on open pilot is gonna uh we're getting there, right? It's a different approach. It's end to end. It approaches it from a different angle, but when Navigate on Open Pilot launches, <coughs> come to Comic Con, uh you will uh be able to type in a destination and the car will go there. Watch the Taco Bell video if you didn't. Uh I love the navigation that's already available in Master. Awesome. Uh, I don't think navigate an open pilot. I think you might have to enable some flags. I'm not really sure what it is. Any plans for outside of US? Are you from India? I, I always get this question from India. Like, it just works, man. I mean, I've seen some of the Indian roads, and no, it doesn't work there. Nothing works there. <laughs> um...
What are you hiding behind that mirror? What? Is that like the Arsenal's punchline? And well, it's not a mirror. It's a it's a whiteboard. Uh, any plans to remove the Can FD hardware? Uh, you know, I, you gotta talk to the hardware team for roadmaps. I'm I'm the president. I don't do roadmaps. Um. Works like a charm in Norway. Awesome. Uh, encrypted CAN buses by votes. Like I said, once main. Ooh, it drove around cones. Oh, look, and we didn't even need to detect the cones. Look at that. Um, oh, should you wait for the next release? I mean, what next release? I don't know what to tell you. Like, what do you think that the comma 4 is going to have that the comma 3 doesn't, right? Like, for the comma 2, everyone was like, Man, oh yeah, no, it needs more cameras, it needs more cameras. And then like we ship the comma three and it has more cameras. Uh, I don't know what else you're waiting for. Uh, navigate an open pilot managed to turn. That's good. Uh, can I talk a little bit more about the longitudinal strategy of cars? So 60 33% uh, of cars use open pilot longitudinal, 33% use stock, and 33% use stock, but have open pilot longitudinal available. That's 66%. That's pretty good for me. Don't chase long tails. Uh, buy a car that's supported. Custom fall distance profiles. Yeah, yeah, didn't you see? Didn't you see the toggle? There's there's a toggle now. You can set aggressive, normal, and chill, uh, and it'll determine how closely it follows and a whole bunch of other kind of aggressiveness maneuvers. Because in general, people who follow close also want aggressive driving in other places. Quick acceleration, uh, slowing down less for turns, all that kind of stuff. The Comma 3 comes jailbroken, that's true. That's true. The Comma 3 is a dev kit. You know, I had someone ask me about that, about the dev kit thing. People are like, Comma doesn't sell a real product. They only sell a dev kit. What do you think a dev kit is, bro? It's a word. If the word dev kit bothers you, it's not for you. But if you're not bothered by words and can see what things actually are, then what's the difference? Ah. Uh, So like profiles from a button, some force will do that, I'm sure. If some things are really good, we'll merge it. Let's look at the warranty. Wait, how do I buy it? Where's the buy button? Oh, this is like a, oh, I'm in some like weird website thing. Here we go. Add to cart. Extended warranty. Um, everything works. Oh, experimental works much better on freeways. Awesome. Um, if you park it in the sun where it's really hot, it may take a few minutes to cool down before you can engage, but it won't break the device. Um, right, because like the device is rated to handle really like 85C, but kind of up to 105 for some components. Um, and you're not gonna get hotter than 85 just sitting on your windshield. You can get up to like, I've seen 80. Uh, but once it turns on, it might go over that. So it's not going to let you engage, but it, you know, it keeps it locked until it cools down. But again, this is only the most extreme uh, weather conditions. Don't sell out. What do you think I'm going to sell out? What do you think the world could possibly offer me, man? Uh, you know, we're here to sell self-driving cars, and it turns out everything just takes a really long time. I think it's going to take seven more years. Uh, I think, I think by the end of the decade, the common devices will be able to, you'll be able to put in a destination, and, um, let's say 99% of the time it gets you there. Um... Well, yeah, right, and that's the other thing, too. Like, having open source software kind of makes you structurally impossible of certain kinds of selling out. Always be afraid when you're using a thing. Like, even if the people are nice now, if you're using closed source software or you're using, God forbid, some web thing, you know, watch out for, like, things like GitHub, you know? Um, they might be nice now, but they can flip a switch. <laughs> Participate in a boxing match against Elon. 
If it's for charity, sure, why not? We love charity, but only like a good charity. Like, like a charity that's gonna like make power cheap. Boxing for cheap power, I love it. Uh, do we need more decam images? More decam images are great. I'm not sure the last time we tried to train a segnat, but you know, more is always better. Um, and we are going to train and ship that model uh, in a bit. So I wanna do a complete car? No, I don't wanna make a car. Why do I wanna make a car? Don't make it free, make it cheap, it's much better. Um, F-150 upstream to master, I think it's gonna happen. I don't think there's really blockers on that. How annoying is the install on that car? Punches for power, yeah, I love it. Cheap power, let's figure out how to make power cheap for everybody. Cheap's good, free's dangerous. Um, free means someone subsidizing you. Would I fight Zuck? Zuck looks jack now, I, I don't know. Uh, yeah, 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 so the only thing that Comet 3 lacks is compute but that's why we put the expansion port on there. It's gonna be hard for us to keep up. Like you can't buy NVIDIA chips. So just buy a cheap gaming laptop, shove it under the seat and connect a wire. Um, now nah, I think Zuck could beat my ass to be honest. Uh, <laughs> I mean now Zuck, not old Zuck. I'd have to, I'd have to practice fighting too. Um, no, I wouldn't fight Destiny. I don't know anything about Destiny, man. Uh, Always bring that one up. I don't know. He's a YouTuber. Uh, does that include EU roads? Oh, because they're so different. It includes everywhere except India roads, okay? Because <laughs> I've seen India roads now. <laughs> and I don't know. Maybe it'll even work there. I don't know. Might work everywhere. You think that matters, though? You think, like, that's the limiting factor? Oh, does it work in the rain? So stupid. It's all about intelligence, right? You build intelligent things and they'll work anywhere that a human does. Can you drive on EU roads? If you're an EU person, can you drive on US roads, right? So why is there a difference? Stop discriminating between silicon life and biological life. Um, wait, what? The VIP tickets sold out? Wait, no, no, that didn't just happen. Wait, oh my God. Wait, this is actually selling tons of tickets. Why did you guys buy general admission tickets and not early saver tickets? But I don't know what to tell you. Yo. No, the early bird sold out, but the early saver didn't. I don't know, 12 people can't read and bought general admission tickets instead of early saver tickets, but I don't know what to say. Uh, <laughs> wow. The candlelit dinner got you guys. All right. All right. I mean, we can't do more. It's VIP. I don't want more than 15 people. If those are legit, then you got the 15 VIPs, man. You should have watched this stream. Uh, right? Um, yeah, we'll, we'll include like, maybe we'll include like five more shots for five more spots for the mega benefactor VIP and it'll be like 10 racks. Um, you guys are making Comic-Con profitable. You know, I love to make things profitable. All right, uh, do we have anything else? You like my Vive Lighthouses? The, the other body, the thing on the top of the body was, a, was a, a Vive Tracker. Used for calibrating our slam system. Uh, C3 works better in the rain than you can see. The C3 never works better than you, but it's not because the cameras can't see. I actually believe the cameras can see better than you can in the rain. I do not believe that it's anywhere near as intelligent as you are. Um, even if you are rather dim-witted. The Comma 3 is even more dim-witted. Um, what do I do all day? Well, I have, I'm the president of Kama, and I founded a new company called the Tiny Corp, and I work there. Um, you can watch my GitHub. You can just, like, I do all my work in public. You can go on my GitHub and watch all my commits. That's what I do all day, I code. Um, cameras can see better than you can see in the rain. Part of the reason for that is the camera is right up close to the windshield. So when you have raindrops hit the windshield, like you need like a wiper to clear them away. But if it's close, it's just like, it's out of the depth of field. So you can just see through it. Um, another nice thing about the Comma 3 is it has two eyes. So like if you happen to get a raindrop in a bad place, the other camera can see, and that already all works. It's putting both into the model. What are you using for slam? We built it. Why should you buy the box? This is not here. We're here to talk about Comma. Um, 
Where do you think we're going to run the comma model? You're going to have to put a tiny box in the back of your car and then connect that to your comma three. Give it some superpowers. Uh, is it spoiler, the simulator? I don't have any simulator stuff planned. Maybe, maybe Harold wants to do a, uh, a stream next week and show it off. Unban you? What? Oh, now you're getting double banned, bro. Um, what is SLAM? Simultaneous localization and mapping. It's the, asking the question, uh, what's the map look like and where am I? Um, supercharged comma three. Sweet. Uh, next week. Sounds good. Uh, yeah, just like drive around a simulator. Just like drivingforever.jpg.gif.mpg.givex. Played in Winamp. Um, can you download the weights of a slam model? It's just, it's the same model. Super combo is slam. I mean, not exactly, but it's, yeah. I'm, I'm, he hears, I don't make, I don't think training should be open source. Um, but I do think weight should be open source. Weights for local inference should be open source. And, uh, uh, obviously the runner should be open source. And that's like what OpenPilot is. I mean, that's like my view on open source machine learning. I think like Llama... And Llama even, Llama could have actually made the weights available for download. We make our weights available for download in OpenPilot. Uh, we have since the beginning. So yeah, the weights are free to download. The architectures are open, but the training stack's closed. Uh, because again, the training stack doesn't benefit individuals. The training stack benefits large corporations. There's only a few people who can run that training stack. Our, our, our uh, supercomputer now costs over a million dollars. Uh, and you just need a million dollar computer in order to train this stuff. So... Um, Acura MDX. I don't know why that one's not supported. Show you server room now. We're not going to server room today. Uh, I have the open pilot lost landscape as picture to the right. Oh, that thing? Yeah. Uh, no, 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 here. Uh, you know what? I, I saw a cool thing. I can show it off. What Wei Xing, uh, was working on this. We're working on confidence, um, that show you how confident the, uh, the open pilot is in this area. So you can see these are places where the confidence is red. Uh, these are places where we, you know, engaging probably won't really work. You can look, you see parking lots, uh, parking lots, driveways, right? Like it's not really gonna work there. Um, what? Oh man. Wait, this is not loading. Oh, we have to like download. Yeah. Uh, these are all videos. It'll be cool when it loads. But yeah, then we have yellow ones down here and you see those are, uh, hang on, let me, let me fix this. Uh, bad Chrome, bad Chrome. I mean, I have so much, I have so much memory in this computer. All right, there we go. What? I think it's just broken. I don't know, you guys wanna try Firefox? Maybe Firefox works. Do I have Firefox? Firefox. Oh, look, Firefox works. All right, cool. Uh, yeah, Chrome, wow, Chrome's just broken. All right, so these are red confidence. Uh, Places where engaging probably won't really work. You see, like, there's, like, a left lane and a pass and where you're hanging on the lane line. Uh, can I send a link to buy the warranty? Uh, you can find it. Just go to common.ai. Uh, so then we can look here. These are yellow areas. So, yeah, these are places where it's going to kind of work. You know, tight traffic, roads, neighborhood... And then we have green areas, and these are places where uh, it's totally just going to work. And you can look, and they're just mostly boring highways. Um, isn't it easier to hire a guy in India to drive the car remotely? You have two problems, latency and incentives. Um, is there some calibration of the confidence? Yeah, so it has to do with its expected number of disengagements per minute. Uh, so you see here... Uh, this is transitions from green to yellow. This is expected to have, you know, one disengagement about every, um, 
well, that many minutes. That unit's not great. Uh, but yeah, oh no, there we go. So green is over 10 minutes, yellow is over one minute, and red is less than one minute. You're gonna have to disengage in. Uh, so we're gonna ship that. That's gonna be like a cool... We need a designer. We're hiring a designer. Uh, if you wanna come work here on design, the best way to get that job is to fix something up in GitHub. Look, I'm not asking you to do six months of work. I'm asking you to do a couple days of work. And if you're not willing to do a couple days of work for a major life change in your life, like a new job, like, I don't know what to tell you, bro. Um, but yeah, fix up something. Show that you can do it. Even just, if you just put some beautiful mocks, like if you're like, I, you know, I can't really code that well and OpenPilot's confusing, or I don't have the hardware to run it. Put some beautiful mocks in GitHub issues. Yeah. Um, additional discount for C3 extended warranties who paid full price. No. Come on. Come on, what are, you, what are you hassling me for? Come on. I try my best. Look, guys, like, using comma, we make money now, but not like shit tons of money. Do you know how much, you know, you know much money I've made off this company? I haven't sold a single share. Um, and I've paid myself, my average salary has been like under six figures, certainly. Um, so, you know, I, I've made not much money. But, you know, it's, it's not about now. It's about the future, right? Like, it's, it's, it's about, you know, eventually this thing's going to print money. Um, exponential growth. It's a hockey stick, guys. Hockey stick. Uh, no, it's not 78000 anymore. I'm actually getting no salary right now because I really only come in, like, one day a week, and it's mostly just for shit talking. Um, so I don't get a salary right now. Uh, also, I have another company, which also doesn't pay me a salary. Um, that company will pay me a salary sooner, though, because we're going to start to make money. Uh, is the square painting a secret message? Yes. Can you decode it? It's steganography. Try the LSB and XR with the Bible. Um, what else we got? Uh, when tiny box will leave soon to you. Uh, yeah, Lisa is cool. We're, we're trying with AMD. Any corporate partnerships in the near future? How is that going to happen? I mean, maybe, I don't know who bought 15 VIP tickets during this stream. Maybe, like, the whole GM executive team is going to be there. And then, you know, we'll see. Um, wow, I, I can't believe the VIP tickets sold out. Like, who bought them? That's just crazy. And what about all the VIPs who are just hearing about it now? You just don't, wow. Oh, maybe there was... I don't know what happened. Whatever. It looks like there might be VIP tickets back. They, only six were sold. I don't really understand. Or maybe we just added more. I don't know what happened, but there's a few VIP tickets left, but it seems like we sold a lot. Oh, if someone has them in the car. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, interesting. There's a comma three void manufacturer warranties. There was plenty of stuff to Google about that. Uh, the, your warranty is between you and your manufacturer, but no. No, it, if your engine breaks, you, they can't void the warranty because you stuck a thing on your windshield. Does it void the warranty on the car? No, look up the, it's like the Magnuson Marsh Warranty Act or something. They also don't break your car. Nobody's ever had a car broken. I think the worst thing that happened, we've had a few fuses blown, and I think the worst thing that happened was a camera ECU, uh, the camera broke, uh, and we actually covered it because it was due to a miswiring in our harness. And I think that happened to one person. Um, so the worst thing that ever happened to anyone uh, was $900 of damage, and we covered it. Uh, and then people have blown fuses, which, two bucks, bro. Um, so yeah, if this thing like breaks your car in normal usage, A, we're very interested in figuring it out. And B, if it was actually normal usage, we'll cover it. Um, again, we've had that happen to one person and it was our mistake and we paid for it. Partnerships would be easy with some vision. Please tell me more about this. Please tell me more about how you think this actually is going to happen. Uh, does comma warranty cover the car? No. Again, if, 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 if like, your, your 
tire brakes, bro. Like, no. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, like I said, we, we, it's not going to break your car. Uh, the, these things are very uh, robust to that. Uh, yeah, I mean, you know what? Don't take my word for it. Look online. Um, it's all electrical. It's not a mechanical mod. So it, it's, it's talking over the CAN bus and it's getting power. Um, can you send back your broken 3D print for warranty? Did you break it or did it break in the course of normal use? If it broke in the case of normal use, then we'll get you a new one. Um, if you broke it, no, buy one. <laughs> um, will OpenPile stack eventually use TinyGrad? What do you mean eventually? It started using TinyGrad six months ago. Uh, and like not even a, like we ripped out SMPE for the main model. It's all in TinyGrad now. How does this guy keep coming back? Remove. All right, we're going to do like five more minutes of stream. Um, I get low IPC. What's IPC? I don't know what that means. Inner process communication? Can you get drunk? Yeah, but don't drive a car. Um, it's never, it, it literally, it's never broken a car. Like, how would that even, like, happen? Look at a car and then look at the... the um, have I tested FSD beta? FSD is, you can read, there's a lot more comparisons online that go into a lot more depth than I'm going to go into, and I've only done, tried FSD beta a few times. Um, but the big difference is kind of how chill they are, right? Like, FSD is like a, I'm driving now. Whereas Open Pilot's like, a, bro, I'm helping you out. All right, our slogans make driving chill. Do I still drive a Kia? Um, my car is actually not supported by Open Pilot, very sadly. Uh, but I'm probably going to sell it and get a new one that is. Uh, is comma rev G pre-production or production hardware? That's production hardware. Uh, Dirty Tesla did a comparison. It's a fair comparison. Yeah, I mean, you can see. Like, I think some people prefer one and some people prefer the other. Some people will tell you. Actually, I do find that most of the sentiment I read says they prefer open pilot to FSD, but I'm probably looking at more open pilot sentiment. Um, no, I do not. I, I actually have a uh, Rolls Royce Ghost. Uh, open pilot dealership packages would be dope. Any dealerships welcome to offer it, right? Um, looking for a designer. Yeah, guys, we're trying to hire a designer, Alex. I shield for this a whole bunch. I really think the interview is that they should just put some mocks or put something up on our GitHub, right? Like, if you want a job here, you know how to get one. I, you know, I, I, I hope the whole world moves to this. I mean, the Tiny Corp's entirely like this. I really hope the whole world just says, like, you know, I don't want your resume. I don't want to do an interview. Why would I do this stuff? Like, this is what we make. Can you help? Right? Because that's the question. That's the fundamental question that's being asked at a job. Um, and then for things where it's like, okay, like our research stack's not open source. So like we have a programming challenge there. We were just saying in the meeting this morning saying every single person who still works at Comma either did well on the calibration challenge, which is a, like a difficult computer vision challenge, or has contributed to OpenPilot before they started working here. And if you're not either of those, why would I hire you? Like you don't work out well, you get fired. And that's just historically what's happened. Uh, injection molding designer. We have a hardware team. Um, who, by the way, uh, the hardware team got hired through the same process. Everyone on the hardware team, actually, the three people on the hardware team all either were external contributors or did well on the challenge despite doing hardware, so... Um, how's the comma body? I mean, you saw the comma body. Watch the beginning of the stream. Have we considered languages other than Python? Let me show you something. How much of OpenPilot do you think is written in Python? All right, this is some myth that OpenPilot is written in Python. Uh, why is the GitHub here? Uh, 
Well, it's more Python than I thought, but it's a uh, 35% C++. So all the stuff that's fast is already written in C++. Product designer, UI, UX designer, brand designer. I don't know what any of this stuff means. You see OpenPilot. I want it to look better and communicate better. Whatever can do that. All right, like, like you saw the lane change thing. It looks terrible. It comes up with a bar that blocks the bottom of the screen that says, bro, you're making a lane change. Like, don't do that, you know? Um, we'll detect speed humps in experimental mode at well, sure. You don't detect it, but it'll slow down. How do you detect speed humps? Do you put a box around a speed hump in your head? Like, I just, I can't even, like, tolerate this anymore, you know? Like, it's, who, who still thinks like that, man? Um, will navigate an open pilot ever be capable of automatic lane changes? Yes. Uh, yes, in certain supported cars, right? Like, y you know, y it's a spectrum of how well supported the car is. But if you have a car, if you have both a comma three and a car like the the EV6, which has good corner radars, yeah, sure. I think I can. I think I think we can make lane changes more reliable than you. Cone guy needs his job. No, he doesn't, man. No, he doesn't. Why is experimental mode so slow? We're working on it. it, it there's challenges. There's challenges in the simulator, and I can talk about why there's a bias toward going slower and going faster, but it, it, like, this might not even be true, but like one theory is that the simulator only has a certain amount of longitudinal range, and obviously slow things are less likely to fall out of the simulation range, so the RL keeps it. I don't know if that's being corrected for, but we're moving to third paradigm models. We're using simulators. It's all going to be better. Um... The comma body is going to do that. Yeah, comma body is going to make ice. No, we're going to open comma coffee. You guys hear about comma coffee? We're doing a mall store too. We're going to open a coffee shop at our office and the robots are just going to serve you coffee and it's just going to print money because we got robot labor, man. Um, and then the software engineers, of course, get paid a lot more to make the robots good. But someday, man, someday three comma bodies are going to get inside an Acura ILX and they're going to drive it to Phoenix and they're going to open a donut shop and they're going to be bring me back a box of cash every month. And I'm like, George, why are they bringing you back a box of cash? Why don't they just send the money wirelessly? And I don't trust that. Put the money in the box and drive it to me. That's right. Um, to have a partner from the community. What? Do you use the product? Fix whatever you think the problem is. You know what I mean? Like, do you have something you don't like about it? Fix it. I suggested one thing, but you can do something else. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, you can't use native cams. You can't use native cams. You can't access them. Insulation is already hard enough. Um, too many people start with forks. <laughs> hey man, it's your product. You can run whatever software you want on it. That's the beauty of it. Um, motorbikes, fuck no. Nobody has died. Nobody has gotten seriously injured with a comma. Part of the reason is because the cars are very safe. Um, not supporting motorbikes. <laughs> Can you get a job validating video data? Are you a computer? Um, none of boats. Uh, live stream, yeah, I wanna do that. I wanna do that from Connect. I think that's with the body stuff. I'm not trying to like measure the benefit. It's like make driving chill. Like you either get it or you don't. Um, Look, we've done no marketing. You don't understand. Like, like advertising, that's great. What devices am I going to sell? I don't have enough little boxes to sell. But this year, we 2x the number of little boxes we're selling. And now it's too many little boxes. The factory can't keep up. So we got to expand the factory and get more little boxes. By the way, we're also hiring a head of production. Um, I'm so shocked at how bad all the applicants are for this role. I want somebody who knows every part in a cell phone. I don't think this is that hard. I'm not going to, like, ask you. I'm not going to, like, troll you and ask you about, like, some, like, 
random, you know, transistor, but I'm going to ask you basically, like, what's in a cell phone and who makes it? And I don't know how people don't just, like, know this. Um, do common devices upload video clips to us? Yes. Is there an option to turn it off? Yes, it's open source software. It's not a toggle. You got to go in and edit it. Um, it doesn't upload. The front camera has a toggle. The main camera uploads by default, but again, it's open source. You can turn it off. Nick is still at comma, yes. Who makes Snapdragon CPUs? Uh, that's a good question. Um, don't give away my interview questions. Um, what is the new product? It is an extended warranty. It is a two-year warranty for your comma three. It is $400. Um, look, it's not for everybody, but I asked about this on Discord, and I said, what are people willing to pay? And, like, at 200 it doesn't make economic sense for me. Uh, at 400 it does. So we did it. Right? It didn't make sense for a long time. And, again, it's not because the failure rate's high. It's because of the increased liability on the company, right? Like, that's a liability, what I'm selling, right? Um, so we have to say, are we going to support the comma three for two more years? And the answer is, yeah. So there you go, right? Like, it's going to be still under warranty, and, and so we're going to... Basically, it's a commitment to kind of support it for two years. Warranty tangible. I don't know what that means. Um, but yeah, you want to look at it. Let's take another look at the warranty. Comacare extended warranty. Come move into IoT. I don't know what IoT means. Uh, no, no, no. It's it's one more year for two hundred. So it's a total of two years of coverage. Uh, that would be committing to support it for three years, and we're not willing to do that. We are willing to commit to support it for two more years. Um, we don't send we don't send things to YouTubers. Linus Tech Tips reached out. You know, I'm not sending you a device. You can buy one. If you don't want to pay for it, you can return it within 30 days. If you want to review it, I'll give me an honest. You know, we're not like I'm not here to like partner and do like that kind of like scummy like. Oh well, we partnered with this 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 YouTuber, and oh, I'm not doing that. I just, I just think it's gross, man. Like I like what Tesla does. They're just like, yo, man, buy a Tesla and talk about it. Cool, buy a comment, and talk about it. Um. One more year, yes, one more year. Uh, this video is sponsored by Common AI. No, they're actually not paying me shit, bro. I swear they're not paying me shit. My salary right now is zero. My uh, equity has been zero for a long time. So, uh, you know, do it for the love of the game. I do it because I'm a shareholder. Sorry. Would love the Common 3. Buy one today. Um... No, oh, they know about comma, but like again, I think they were expecting something different from us. Like I, I think that they reach out to these consumer electronics companies. They're like, "Oh, Linus Tech Tips, this is our big break." And I'm like, "Bro, like review it if you want, buy one if you want, talk about it. I mean, we appreciate it, but like, don't do it if you don't want, right?" Uh, can you buy our shares? Not really. Some are very few are available on the second market. Uh, but the only real way to get comma shares is to come work here. Uh, one year warranty is actually uh, mandated. One year manufacturer warranty is actually uh, mandated, at least in California. 50% um, discount on parts. No. If you break your, if you damage your screen, those screens cost me way too much money. I, like the new screen is a bit cheaper, but they still cost me way too much money. I'm very upset at how much I'm spending on screens because I know how much phone people are spending on screens and it's a lot less. I'm never going public. Why would I want to be owned by bankers? You're not going public, right? There is no public. The public is the oligarchy, and the oligarchy is the banks, right? So if you want to be owned by bankers, then you can go public. If you want to be owned by people, then, you know, you stay private. They'll send in your PR. All right. How is this guy... How come there's no ban? How come there's no ban? Maybe I'll add him as a moderator. You know, we'll do a full 180. Um, can't buy it due to Toyota TSK. Buy, uh, we have votes for that. All right, two more minutes. Don't ban you, law. Banned. Banned. Two more minutes. Any last questions? Uh, how hard is 
buying a comma for a brand new car and fingerprinting it for a software engineer? Very easy. It should just work. Uh, if you're saying your car is not supported, it depends. If the model is not supported, but the brand is, it's probably an hour of work. If the brand's not supported, well, I think we kind of support all the brands now, but if the brand's not supported, it's a lot of work. What older Toyota do I recommend? A 2021 Corolla is fire. A TSS2 Corolla is a great car. I mean, look, it's a great car for comma. I personally hate the Toyotas, but that's just me. Um, I just think they're like, it's loud, you know? Buy a Hyundai Sonata if you want a nice car. I got my parents to buy a Hyundai Sonata. What music are you listening to? Hyperpop. Um, how long will it be before a comic can be used on all types of vehicles? It already can. Is Tesla supported? Not really. It's like saying, like, do you want to run Android and iOS? Um, <laughs> you should make it possible to search cars by type. I mean, how many minivans are there? The new website's the best one we've done. Um, have I bought any new cars? No, we're kind of done buying new cars. We're trying to improve the ones we have. Um, by the way, can you believe that GM canceled the Bolt? Like, they finally got a car that some people are buying, and they're like, you know what we should do? Let's cancel it. Yeah, that's brilliant. Oh, I love your executive thinking. Let's go make partnerships. Um, why don't I advocate for stopping AI? Why would I want to do that? I love AI. Um, stopping progress? Why would you want to stop progress? Aren't you a progressive? I'm a progressive. I love progress. Only conservatives want to stop progress. Yeah. Your faith in GM dissolved after they canceled the vault. Oh, with a V. Oh, we're really going back now. Um, hiring remote people. Comma does not hire remote. Uh, Tiny Corp does. Uh, Comma has a strict no remote policy. We have a beautiful office here. Uh, no remote. Uh, but Tiny Corp will hire you remotely, but you got to contribute. Um, you missed the product announcement. The product is a Comma Care one year extended warranty for your Comma 3. It's $400, and this is the fine print, and you can read it. Um, people always ask, George, but what's going to happen when this is out of warranty? You should really offer a two year warranty. Now we do. You can buy it. It's $400. But that's so much money. It's cheaper than a Comma 3 was originally. Comma 3s originally were. $19.99. Now comma threes are $14.99. So for the kids in the back, what's $14.99 plus $400? That's right, $18.99. You still save $100 and get a two-year warranty. What a deal. Um, have sales gone up? Yes, yeah, sales have 2x since the price decrease. Sales have 2 x It's hard to disambiguate, but between the Taco Bell video and the price decrease, we are 2 xing the number of devices we're selling. Are there any OEMs that wanted to integrate it? OEMs have reached out again, like buy a phone call. We sell phone calls. If any OEMs would like to talk to us, we sell phone calls for $1,000. Um, hotel conference rate discount codes. I don't know, Alex, can we do that? Can we like promise like 20 people are gonna buy something and get a discount on a hotel? It sounds like a good deal. Uh, thoughts on Aptera? Uh, you know, I'll see what, uh, let's see what they have when they ship. Uh, you know, I also am curious how safe that car is. Uh, but if they ship something and it's safe, good for them. I mean, again, it's probably safer than a motorcycle, but that is one of my concerns about that car. It's not like, you know, is it as safe as a Toyota RAV4? Eh, Prius? Eh. You know, I've, I've seen Priuses hit concrete barriers at, a, at, at, at 70 miles an hour and everyone walks away. Um, I've never seen a motorcycle do that. Uh, but no, look, Aptera, look, Aptera is an example of if companies want to use OpenPilot, they're welcome to just use it. It's open source software. It is our trademark. You don't have to acknowledge that it's our trademark if you want to use OpenPilot. If you want to fork OpenPilot, MIT license is super permissive. Um, uh, your comma, thanks for banning my comma three. Your comma three will be banned from our network uh, only if you mess with safety code. Uh, if you mess with safety code, if you mess with driver monitoring, or you try to raise torque limits, uh, you'll be banned. Right? Like, again, I'm not here to stop you from doing this stuff. What I am here to say is, I don't want anything to do with you. Or some guy was asking in Discord, like, can I disable the seatbelt check, and will I get banned? Yeah, you'll get banned, right? Don't mess with the safety. 
Uh, again, getting banned doesn't mean that the police come to your house, right? It's just, it's just saying that we don't want to associate with you uh, if you want to mess with safety. But if you don't mess with safety, by all means, look, tons of people out there uh, go out and run, uh, and run forks. We're very supportive of forks. Um, forks that change. You can change a lot of stuff without touching the safety. Uh, no, actually, we don't send, no, but some, someone did, uh, did try a return scam on us, and we sent a PI to their house, we took the device back, and I'm filing a police report later today. Do not steal from Kama. Uh, no, like, I'm very serious about this. He's going to be super upset when the police come to his house, but do not steal from me. Like, you're stealing from me. Um, what does it mean to be in the network? It means that your device can connect to our servers and use our backends and all that stuff. Uh, I will only go after them if they associate themselves with Kama. If you, you can run whatever code you want. You bought the device from me. I don't care. I'll just ban you from the server, right? I'm not going to go after you. I will go after you if you buy a device from us and try to do, like, a fraudulent chargeback. Oh, hell yeah, I'll go after you. Um, all right. Thank you for watching today's stream. This stream has been brought to you by... The Comicare Extended Warranty. Comicare Extended Warranty. Only $400. Uh, you can buy it for either a new Comma 3 or a Comma 3 you purchased in the last year. Obviously, for obvious reasons, I hope you can figure out. I can't sell you an extended warranty on something that's not in warranty. Um, also sponsored by Automatic Plant Watering Systems. Bought from Amazon. It waters the plants for you so you don't have to. Um, I said it wasn't sponsored. Well, I probably lied. Uh, thank you. Thank you all for watching today's stream. Um, it's not weed. <laughs> what was the new product? The new product is a warranty. That's why product was in quotes. Uh, have I tried home assistant? I don't know what that is. All right, guys. Thank you for watching the stream. Have a good day. Buy a warranty. Come to Comic-Con. And if you want to come work here, it's pretty easy. Uh, can you buy a warranty even if you don't own a comic? You can, but it's a donation. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you.